is up the world it is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here and i'm out of hammer hanging out today doing some things playing tug in the new mine i'm in a new little mine area that i made and we got a bunch of stuff and things we're going to do today i'm super excited about it because there's new metallurgy things going on hey what up what up rock what up weird thing i cannot get out oh are you serious how come this is a thing now when i was just able to get out two seconds ago Thankfully, oh, I do have another hammer. Let's head back down for a second. So yeah, um, there's new stuff and things going on in Tug. There's new metallurgy update, and so we're gonna go ahead and build all the stuff and things that are uh, required to do that today. And I'd like to get into a, a new bronze pick and a new bronze sword today. I saw those and they look really rad. Maybe the spear too. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. All right. So that that'll be good for now. Uh, actually, whatever. <laughs> Indecision is my middle name. Uh, I just want to waste the rest of that that hammer and we got this hammer rock if we oh wait we we might be trapped down here forever so i could get out no problem before i'm not sure exactly why there we go i got out and i built a little uh trail a little torchy trail over so you can build torch out of those wood handles too so i was doing that for a minute and all right so we got a bunch of stuff and things here now let's go ahead and put this away uh let's go ahead and put some of this garbage away so yeah this is my boulder area <laughs> so so much stuff and things definitely um a challenge oh seriously <laughs> definitely a challenge to like have enough room to store all your stuff uh got to figure out a better way to do that stuff too so oh man we got a bunch of cobble too a huge amount of big cobble from that it takes like you know at first when i was when i was playing this game i was thinking that it took like really it felt like a really long time to get resources for building um, I was wrong. It does not. Especially, like, cobble. Look at all this, man. I'm going to be able to build something rad out of that stuff eventually. Eventually! We're going to get a couple more things going, and then the plan is to probably move on and maybe build another house, like a more proper house? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, Alright, so, bunch of things we want to do today. I still got some crap on me i got to get rid of. I just don't want to carry around a lot of stuff with me when I'm doing this stuff. Let's drop that right there. Am I clear? Alright, I feel clear. So, um... Yeah, so now we've got all these ores, and we saw in the last episode, so you can mine, well, not all of them, but a couple. Copper, tin, and coal are things. So, um, also now, we've got, like, hardened wood that we can make. So, if you take a wooden shaft, and you put it uh, by a campfire that's got fire, like, a, you know, it's lit up, uh, then you can make the hardened wooden shaft. Now, if you stick this guy onto our crude workspace, and, oh, you know what? I'm going to need to make a hammer for all, all this stuff. So, let's grab a hammer rock. One of these guys. Tell me I have one. Oh, I have no handles. You're supposed to be able to transmute mute handles um, from wooden shafts. And I did it one time, but then it would not, like, do it again. So I don't know. Oh, now it's doing it. Maybe it has to be that it's only singles, like I was putting groups of them up there. All right, so let's put this down. Put this down. Put that down. Make a hammer. Because some of these crafting recipes now require that you have a hammer like equipped in order for them to work so that's what we're gonna be doing all right so we got that and then you can make hardened wood as well this is hardened wood um and that isn't something i showed off before that's made by just um having wood in the fire the fire like stoked and putting chopped wood next to it all right so we got this guy now i'm pretty sure can we just g this or do we have to have the hammer all right no we don't have to g it so now we can make these guys hardened wooden handles so let's go ahead and G this guy too. Make two more hardened wooden handles. And those are used in crafting stuff and things we're going to be making today. All right, so we got that. Now we need, what is it? Two of these hardened wood, two of these guys. And, oh crap, oh, I'm already forgetting what the recipe is. I think it's a hard wooden shaft. So, all right, let's make one. Oh, we have one right here. All right, so this is going to be for the bellows. So I know we need this guy, or is it the handle that we need for this? Let's put these strips down. I think it's the handles, actually. And then G that guy. Ooh, does it work? Bam! All right, yeah, that's what we needed. We need that, and then that makes the bellows. So now we got our bellows, and we're going to need, I do believe it is right here. So we need six cobblestone. Um... We need the bellows down on here. We need hardened wood. I can't remember if it's four. <laughs> All right, let's equip this guy. Is that it? No. Is it this guy? Oh, it's doing it. 
I think this is going to be wrong. It's going to make handles. Yeah, crap. Um, let's put this in our hand and try again. I can't remember if it's the handles or the hardened wood. No, maybe it'll work now that we got that. Crap, man. I can't believe I forgot the recipe. Uh, that stinks. So give me just a second here. Oh, man. I should have written this, written this stuff down, man. Oh, crap. So, um, would love to have, like, some sort of book or something to tell you what the recipes all are. Because uh, trial and error with this stuff is a pain in the, in the butt. We just definitely don't want to do that. Um, let's put this stuff down. G, 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 G's. Oh, man. Man, I wish I could remember what it was. Um, we got a lot of crap on the table now. So, four hardened wood, six cobble, one bellows. Um... Was it coal? Oh, yeah, I think it is. I think it is coal. And we'll just put one down. Then equip the hammer. Success? Success! I think I got it. And that should make this thing. <laughs> now, I'm just going to go ahead and pick that up. Uh, let's make it day because it's about to be night. Eh, it's like afternoon-ish. So this guy, the stone furnace. So we gotta find a good spot for our stone furnace. I'm thinking that right here will be good. Uh, nope, let's pick it back up. Um, let's do that Z thing. Oh man, that doesn't help me at all. Um, yeah, this stuff is a little bit, I'm stuck inside of it. This stuff's a little bit hard to place. There should be definitely, um, I think, a better way to place things. Um, and I know somebody in the tutorial, uh, in the last video I, I think had uh, giving me like a tutorial on how this stuff all works and that's all well and good like it's great that there are different ways to do it but it's just in my opinion too difficult um, to place things so like I can't I just cannot figure out a good way to get this thing placed down um, in the direction that I want and then having it be like on the ground ish <sighs> all right let's try one more time I'm 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 pretty I'm pretty uh, confident. All right. I love it. It's perfect. It's exactly where I wanted it, kind of. So, um, all right. Now we can do some things with this. So let's go ahead and head over here. We need this wood, four hardened wood, and some clumps of sand here. Put this down. Three? Was it three clumps of sand? And then this guy... All right, so four hardened wood, three clumps of sand, and then have your um, hammer equipped, and then you get this guy. That is the sand cast mold. All right, cool. So let's head over here, sleep the night away. Good morning. Oh, all right, our sand cast mold is a thing. So now we're gonna go ahead and place this guy right here. Perfect, perfect placement. Um, and now we need to make a laden. So I do believe what we're going to need, let's go ahead and we stick a hole in here. Let me see, I don't know. Can I do, let's, let's test this out real quick. So if we do two in our hand and squirt one, all right, squirts one in at a time. Sweet. All right. So then we're going to drop one of these, one of these. Come back here, man. Get on. What? <laughs> Yay. All right. And then we're going to craft that. And that makes the laden. Sweet. So the laden, now I do believe if we, we need to make a couple tools. So do we have any more? Uh, yeah, we got one, right? All right, let's make the pick first. So in order to do this, we've got to squirt. We need a pick rock. And we've got to make a pick. And this is kind of like how you would do it, like, I mean, Earl. You know what I mean? So we put this guy down, one of those guys down. That's the laden. Where'd my pick rock go? There it is. Bam. G that bad boy. Sweet. So now we got our pick. All right. We take our pick. Come over here to our thingy doodler. Drop this guy. Drop the laden. And I can't remember if we've got to have the hammer equipped or not. Oh, sweet. All right. So we did it. Made a thing. So this made bronze pick head. Now, I do believe we need leather straps for this. Thank God for Goat Friends, the last episode. So, um, now over in our crude crafting area here, we're going to put that guy down, put one handle, one leather strip, and then G. I thought you had to have your hammer equipped for a bunch of this stuff. 
Sweet! Oh, so cool! This thing looks rad. Let's stick it down. It's pretty rad, right? It's not bad. And the whole idea of the next tier tools is that the durability is, like, drastically increased. All right. So now we want to make another laden. Because um, I want to play around with the sword. So let's drop this guy. Drop this guy. Gee, these bad boys. For another laden. Sweet. And then we have a sword already now, but it has a little bit of damage. So I'm not really sure how this is going to work. Let's see. Is it just going to work and be amazing? Oh, man! This thing looks rad! That, like, straight out of... Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't step up. Cut yourself, man. That's, like, straight out of, like... Something from Tolkien. That looks like Elvin. Elvian. That's not even a word. It, well, it could be if you made it up. Um, Elvin design. So we're just going to call this thing Glamdring the Goat Hammer, I think. That's going to be the name of it. All right, so we're going to put this down. One of these bad boys. One of these bad boys. G this up. Those Chika Kikonoko demons are... Oh, man! They got nothing. Look how cool it is. How cool does it look? My hair changed color again. Oh, yeah. Get some. Get some. He looks so unimpressed. Uh -huh. Yeah, you know. Sword. You can go like this. You can go like that. That's about it. You can go like this. Or like that. <laughs> All right. So we got a rad sword now. That is so rad. Um, and now we got our pick as well. And then you can do that, for I do believe, for all the tools. So for shovel, uh, hose, all that stuff. You can do all that. Um, so now I want to... Oh, you know what? I'm a little bit hungry. I feel like it's time for a steak. Uh, let's go ahead and drop some of our crap. Um, stack these bad boys up. And uh, yeah, so storage is definitely a concern. Um, and I'm assuming that we're going to see, since we do have that chest, uh, chests like in the future coming up. Which would be rad. So we can kind of, I don't know. The storage pits are neat and cool and interesting and new and all of that. Um, but a little bit of a pain. So I'm hoping for that soon too. Um, what were we going to do over here? Oh yeah, let's quirt this guy over here. Um, and we'll actually, let's pick all this up and combine it. And then re redrop it. Alright, getting it down. Getting it down. Alright, so um, now we got our super pick. Squirt that guy right there. And uh, let's go ahead and head over and take a look at the durability difference. Now, it, it really isn't that tough to make this stuff. Uh, especially once you get the stuff and things going. I mean, it really isn't that much harder than just making... Um, let's go ahead and get rid of some of this. So we can make sure we can get out a little bit easier. Uh, really isn't that much diff more difficult than making um, just the regular stone tools. So let's take a look at the durability. It's not drastically increased. But it's definitely increased. So if you were to make a couple of these guys that come down here and uh, start doing some digging, you can see you can get... I think I, I feel like probably the durability is about doubled. But we're going to rail through this guy really quickly. Now, I did have that durability potion. And honestly, I'll tell you, I have no idea what happened to it. Um, I had set it down somewhere and it kind of just went away. Uh, so I'm not really sure what happened there. Um, whoops. So that's another thing that goes on sometimes. Um, yeah, it, it, that's another thing I was going to mention to you guys is that it, it, you have to be really careful when you're like mining or something like that, when you're picking stuff up. Because when you pick something up and if you don't hit it just right, you're going to mine the block underneath. Um, so that's a little bit weird. Um, but yeah, all right. So we got a bunch more stuff and things. We can make a bunch more of these picks now. Um, I feel like I'm running low on some resources. So, um, one of the things that I don't have a lot of right now is... Let's go ahead and grab this stuff and combine it. What I don't have a lot of right now is um, wood stuff. Like, I just got to cut down trees, man. Um, and so, let's just get rid of this little stuff right here. What else? Is that more cobble? All right, right now. So, yeah, I, I'm running low on wood. Um, and so, that bronze axe would probably be rad to make. Um, maybe we can just do that together right now. So, um, we're going to need, we got the axe right here. We'll just need to make another laden. So that should be pretty, or is it laden? I don't know. I could be pronouncing it wrong, but you know, that's just the way life is sometimes. You just pronounce things wrong. All right. Yeah. Don't laugh at me, Kika Demon. Um, G in this bad boy, making that laden. Sounds like a song. Yo, yo, what up? G in this bad boy. Uh, and let's go ahead and squirt this guy down. Squirt that guy down. 
and make this guy. Oh, man. And you know what? Oh, that's right. Also, there's a spear that looks really rad uh, that we could get into, too. So, um, 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 uh, these guys and hardened handles. Let's go ahead and make this axe and see what's up with it. One of them. One of those. Did that drop both? No, it did not. One of these. And we'll make the super axe. Take a look at it. It looks pretty good. I mean, the, uh, these new tools do look great. I think they're cool looking for sure. He's so unimpressed. You can go like this. You can go like that. So, um, alright. So, let's go ahead and take a look at cutting some trees down. I'm going to go right over here. And just take these guys out. Not bad, not bad. All right, let's pick up some of this crap. All right, so the next thing I feel like I got to get done is just getting some raw materials done up. Um, I want to have, you know, a bunch of wood going, a bunch of, like, handles, a bunch of just all the stuff and things that I need. And I am running a little bit low. It's surprising. You'd think that, you know, you'd get 15 or 20 of these guys going and then you'd be good to go. But you blow through the resources quick in this game, man. It's kind of crazy. Um, all right, so I think we're going to take a couple minutes, go ahead and gather up some more wood stuff and things, and I will BRBs. And we're back, and I'm about to make something, I think. Let's go ahead and take a look here. I think we're going to make the spear next, just because I want to play around this thing. It looks pretty rad as well, so check it out. It's cool, man. It's a cool spear. So I don't know exactly how this thing works. Let's go ahead and... He's still so unimpressed. It's a spear. Goes like this. Go like this. Go like that. So, um, you're supposed to be able to throw these things, too. Let me see here. Do I hold? Do I middle mouse click? Wait, what happened? Oh, middle mouse click as well cycles through your weapons. So, you're supposed to be able to throw these guys. That's my crouchy crouch. Nah, I'm not quite sure exactly how to throw it. There's a way to do it. Um, I gotta check it out. I gotta look it up. But one of the things that I did want to show you guys, remember how earlier I had, um, I had my potion durability? If you remember, these durability potions are made in the cauldron. You need wood chips and a gourd flask. That's it. So the way you actually use them is you equip the the uh, potion in your slot, and then you put the item down. Now, um, before I do this, let's go ahead and let's pick this guy back up. And then just take a look. See the durability down there in the two slot? There it is, durability. So we'll stick this guy down. Bam. Completely fixed. And it looks like this thing's got three, four or five uses. So super amazing, actually. To be honest with you guys, that's like uh, like beyond awesome. Um, really, really cool that you can just go ahead and repair this stuff and things so easily. Um, but now we've got our spear. We've got our sword. We've got our axe. We've got our pick. And I feel like... It's time to go on a bit of an adventure, um, as scary as that may seem. Um, one of the things that I'm running low on is, let's get our sword out. One of the things that I'm running a little bit low on is leather. So killing some goats, having another goat frenzy would be sweet. But I also wanted to just head out here and just see what there is out in this, like, I don't know what you want to call it, like this wasteland area. It's pretty crazy looking out here. Um, and without... Unfortunately, without bringing torches with me, it's going to be a little tricky to, like, find my way around and find my way back. But I feel pretty confident that I can do it. Like, you know, well, hopefully it'll be a thing. But I just wanted to go out a little bit and just take a look at what this thing has to offer, this place has to offer. It looks like there's some crazy ravines here. The world gen in this area is pretty awesome looking. Um, let me see here. Some different trees up here I wanted to check out. See what these guys are all about. What are you, the weird trees? Joshua trees. I love those guys. Um, and then there's like some other weird plants. Young cane stock. Can we just punch this thing? We can punch that little thing. Young cane stock, come to me. We gotta cut it down. Oh! Oh, oh, cool. You can make, um, there's like a spiked hook thing that you can make with this guy. Right on. We'll grab a couple of these just to have. So it looks like you've kind of got to venture out into different, like, uh, for lack of a better term, biomes. Or, you know what I mean? In order to get, like, the different items, some of the different items, you must come out here. Is that just, oh, it's just a leaf. 
just a super crazy floating leaf. The other thing that's odd I'm noticing about this area is like back in my area, there are tons of those stone tables, like the ancient tables and all of that. Doesn't seem like there is a lot of them here. Cactus, man. Oh, this is, must be what you get. Like, there's spiky things you get from this. Yeah, there's that's, again, part of uh, the crafting recipe for a weapon. So grab a couple of cactus thingies. But those, yeah, those table things aren't around. And I don't want to go too far because I feel like I'm already kind of on the edge of getting lost. I think if we come back this direction... I don't want to fall into a ravine. We should be good to go. It is getting dark, too. This is suddenly a scary adventure. So if we come upon the ridge here... Oh, wait. This isn't the ridge. Am I lost? No. Okay, I'm not lost. If we come upon... If we come over in this direction... No, no. Am I stuck? Crap. Oh. Uh, <laughs> dig? How come you is no dig? Why is you no dig? So yeah, if we come up onto the ridge here and just go like so, we should be able to see torches, man! Found my road! Alright, so we're good to go. And then our house is back over in this direction. Um, how much stuff do I have on me? Eh, a little bit. Um, so that's the metallurgy update, and I'm not really sure. Oh, there's one other thing I forgot to show you guys. If you put a four hardened wood on this bad boy... And I think you have to put the hammer rock on it. Something, something like that. That'll make you guys this thing, the stone anvil, which is another crafting space, like similar to the crude crafting workspace, the crude workbench, all that. So, um, yeah, and I'm not really sure, pers right now, off the top of my head, exactly what we use that guy for. Um, we need, like, a special space for... I'll just stick them in here for now. For cactusy things. So we'll stick those down like that. Let's go ahead and sleep as well, because I'd love to go on a little bit longer of an adventure. <laughs> but I got oh, the sun starts going down, man. I start freaking out. I don't want to be out there at night. I don't know what's out there in the badlands there. Um, something else that I wanted to show you guys that I did. A few of you commented on this to help me out. I went ahead and tilled a bunch of the land here, used the hoe and hoed it out. And then when I was placing these seeds in the lower left, I wasn't noticing the message. She has picked up pumpkin seeds times five too close to other items. So um, what I did was move some of the things around in this area and then I planted some of these gourd seeds here um, so that we um, can get the gourds because they are good. Is that? These are fully grown. All right, sweet, so we can harvest them. Because we want to use these gourds for making potions, especially that potion of durability because it's pretty BA. I mean, let's be honest. That is pretty crazy as far as um, the amount of stuff and things that we can do with it. Um, the, abil the ability to repair uh, your tools that easily and successfully um, is pretty great. That's like really, really great. I'm excited about that because it just means that you don't have to do quite so much crafting. Um, and the tools this way also, like you can go, you know, you can go down in your mine or whatever and then you don't have to come back up like every, you know, you'd have to build like just a couple of items and then you'd have to come up and go down and come up. Um, and it, it, it feels like this way you can kind of spend a little bit more time down there and not have to craft quite as much stuff, which is pretty awesome. Um, so these Badland thingy places are pretty crazy, man. I'm not, wow, the baby screaming. Um, really kind of neat. And I'm not, I'm not sure. Hey, what up, pumpkin? I'm not sure what other types of biomes there are around. Oh, I think these mushrooms are different. Ghost mushroom, because these are like the ghost finger guys, right? Can I not see it from here? <laughs> Can I just punch you? <laughs> Can I axe you? Ghost mushroom chunk. Not sure if these are useful. Sweet, that one's in the tree. Perfect. All right, cool. So, um, yeah, I think that I feel like it's time to go on a little bit of a goat hunt. <laughs> we need some more leather straps for stuff and things for tools. Um, I guess, man. I mean, honestly, as long as we're really careful, all we need now are wood chips and goat flasks, and, that, and that's all you need. You don't really need to build your tools again. You just need to build them the one time, and that's it. Maybe we'll try the spear out here. There's a goat. I wish I knew what the key was. F, G, H. Oh, what did H do? Where'd it go? I really wish I knew what the key was. This thing seems to go slow, too. Let's go with the sword. Oh, man. Um, let me finish my thought. I wish I knew what the key was to throw those things because I really want to try that out. Um, 
can we maybe escape out of here and just look in the options input let's take a look here crouch jump pick use toggle stance is t maybe it, whoa what just happened <laughs> t yeah that's it t oh man i threw it can i pick it up yes oh you're done you're done goat Ugh. oh he dodged it super goat the smartest goat ever. T? Oh, I bounced. Man, the... Oh, wow, that's so cool. Those work really well. Like, just as far as the mechanic of how it works is really good. Where'd you go, goat? Oh, I want to hit you with this so bad. Yes, don't move. Oh, it's, it's sword time. You're done, goat. Oh, K.I. Oh, man. Super nice. Um, all right. Not sure if I can skin this bad boy with my sword. Yes. Oh, wait. Is that the no animation? I think I feel like I might need my knife. It's using durability. Crap. I don't have my, like, little crude knife on me. Can I axe it? Just by chance? Pick? No? Nothing's going to work. So it looks like I need a bronze knife now uh, as well. And I'm not sure. Jeez, I'll be honest with you. I'm not sure if you can make a bronze knife. Um, let's head back to the house, I, which I think is this way, um, and see if we can make that bronze knife. Uh, no need for punch. Ooh! Ah! Get him! Crap! Stance! Go! Oh, man, it bounced! Is it T? I'm going to get him. Oh, stupid tree. Oh, he's so fast. Super go. Oh, stand right there. I'll hunt him. Oh, crouch. We'll hunt him in a hunty way. There he is. He's stuck. No, oh, what happened? <laughs> I totally hit you, man. Peace out, goat. Oh, come on. Uh, where'd my... Where'd my... Did I lose my spear? Oh, no. C crap. It was right over... There it is. All right, sweet. I got my spear back. <laughs> I swear I hit that goat. I swear to God. All right, we can't miss. There's no way. Come on, man. How is it that I can't kill this goat? Uh, oh, I got him! <laughs> All right, one shot, man. Perfect. One shot, one hit, I guess I should say. 26 shots, one hit only. So it's just my poor aim uh, that was stopping me. Oh, you know what? Speaking of, uh, I'm hungry. Let's go ahead and... What's that going on right there? Looks like some sort of visual glitch. Um, All right, so let's go ahead and eat some of these guys. Oh, man, that's too funny. So, um, a little bit odd. A little bit odd how that all works. Um, let's grab a couple more of these good cherries. And we'll just throw the rest on the ground. I feel bad littering. I can't litter. Um, Alright, so we gotta head back to the house. Let's follow the ridge here. And then that should lead us to our... Oh, I think it's right here. Yeah, I see it. So, uh, oh my god. Too funny, man. Too crazy. So, really cool. I don't know. I feel like we got a lot, a lot of stuff and things accomplished today. We got the bellows. We got the uh, sandy thing. We got the anvil. We got all sorts of new bronze tools. You know, we still have our handy-dandy trash can. Oh, that's a little glitchy. Get in there. Perfect. And, yeah, so we're doing good. We got our, our durability potions going. Um, I don't know. For next time, I almost feel like... Oh, ooh. Let's get him. T. All right, it's not working. Let's go faster. <laughs> I just want to spear goat so bad right now. Oh, man, they're so quick. They just move out of the way so quickly. Um, we'll just have to T out. Sorry, no no more of that for today. But, yeah, I feel like we're getting a lot accomplished. We've got a little garden going. Um, I really think that it might be time to, like, build a different area, like a proper house or something. Um, and I, I think that we're just going to do it right over in this area here. 
Um, it is the closest area that is kind of super open and clear. Um, and I feel like I could clear cut it pretty, like clear it out pretty easily. Um, it's difficult to find open spaces and um, it's really also, I'm finding it difficult. I, I want to keep like the grass and the ground really nice and natural, but you can't, there's just nothing you can do to take these plants out. So like I would be, con I would be uh, content staying right here if we could clear these plants, but it just seems like it's not like a possibility. Um, I can't remember. It might be this that I'm being dumb. Um, let's go ahead and see if we grab dirt. Let's grab some dirt. Let's just test this out real quick. Let's grab our pick. And let's take this out. Because there's like grass all in here. And then let's take this dirt and use it. See? Well, you can't do that. But then you end up with like dirt spots. And it's not like grassy. You know what I'm saying? So, anyway, yeah, that's why I think I want to move over to that area. Maybe start building some sort of different proper house. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, I, and I hope the crying baby people allow me to do it. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today, guys. I hope that you had fun. If you guys are like and tug, make sure you hit the like button. Oh, man, phew. feel free to share and favor the video as you see fit. Don't spam it on Reddit, peeps. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.